Hello guys, this is Sam. Welcome to my channel. I'm playing Starfield. I should have taken the suits from that guy who was trying to kill us. Crime, take it to local security. They handle that stuff. Mostly to keep an eye on the smuggling trade. Black market goods flow through Neon like a river. Can't stop it, but I can at least keep an eye out in case it's something real serious. Think nothing of it. Word of advice. Enjoy the city, but know your limits. Trouble's waiting around every corner. The law won't protect you the way it does in other places. Law and authority aren't always the same thing. In Neon, they're almost the opposite. People with authority don't much care about the law. Make the wrong enemies here, you're better off just leaving the planet and never looking back. I don't need to preach, but prudence will serve you better than bravado around here. There's something else you need? Believe it or not, yeah, it was. My mother's an executive with Ryujin, so I grew up here. I volunteered for this post as much to keep the other rangers out of trouble as any other reason. If some hotshot rookie took this job and started flashing the badge everywhere, it wouldn't end well. Nah, I've got friends in high places, so to speak. I'm the son of a Ryujin Industries executive. Maybe you've heard of her? Name's Alexis Price. There's a sort of fragile peace here in Neon. It's better for everyone if the syndicates and the corporations coexist with minimum friction. Later. Dumbbell contraband away. <laughs> Gunslinger's Guide. So, Chota Mata Cheese Chori Kar Gaya. Badnam Ni Ona Rai. Surprise, terrible. Every time there were no survivors. Places abandoned. 
Selling or moving? Yeah? Well, then let me spell it out for you. You either walked into the TA to buy some goods, sell some goods, or have some liberated goods taken off your hands for a reasonable price. So, instead of wasting my time making me explain how the business world works, let's get a move on. Cages. We get along just fine. As long as I stay out of their business, they stay out of mine. On a rare occasion that I've run into something that's red hot, Ranger Price swings by as a follow up. We put our heads together and figure it out. It's never really been a problem. You can ask him if you like. Always happy to take your money. Okay. This one. This Nova light. I don't know what this is. This one. This looks like a shotgun. This one has more accuracy than the other one. I will take this too. like uh This one. 
looks like a sniper man. Drink pack, mean pack. These two are contraband items. If I even take that, I will have to pay a fine for that. So I will think about something about the guns later on. Devin and Ash, this is run into some trouble. Worth the wise? We don't want a piece of that. <laughs> Get out of my face. You want to go get something? Take it to the Astro Lounge. Don't move, Nesha! There should be a sign, dump your Aurora here. There's nothing in the cell systems quite like me now. Crazy and terrible, I never know me. this no errors okay so i told you guys that i'll just see that later as you can go over mission Less mass, 
fast travel is easy. So we need to talk to the guy in this. Land the confidential files. Sorry. Standard level. Range increases. Mods decreases. Value decreases a little bit. Max increases. Aquila is one of the oldest cities in the settled systems. Quite handy with those tools. Yeah, 
अच्छा कुछ मिला है लेकिन क्या मिला है जो कॉन्फिडेंशियल फाइल मेरे को वहाँ पे प्लांट करना था मैंने कर दिया मैं वहाँ पे थोड़ा घबरा गया था क्योंकि वहाँ पे खोलने के बाद आप मोबाइल पे खोलोगे वो मिसेलिनियस में आइटम रहेगा उस आइटम में सिलेक्ट करोगे तो अपने आप वही बात करेगा उसमें I'm already enlisted in UC. 
then I became a ranger of Free Star Collective and now I am working for this guy, this lady. I don't know how many jobs I have to take. I was hoping you'd show up soon. Is it done? Excellent. I'll let Ularo know that we can start moving forward with our negotiations. Now, I think it's time to examine a different set of skills. Nice to see I haven't worn you out yet. Your next assignment is to find the security chief and use some creative thinking to obtain their security keycard. And when I say creative, I don't mean with a weapon. Either look the part and be persuasive, or be quick with your hands. A security chief isn't going to give the time of day to just anybody. A nice suit should do the trick. Or, who knows, some operatives are known to have a security guard uniform or two in their closet they can rely on. Just be careful. Getting caught could mean a mess, and cleanup isn't cheap. We just need some easy access to competitor security. Sometimes obtaining a legitimate form of access is preferred over brute forcing it. Good luck. I'm sure you'll be able to get that key card without incident. Just remember, if anything does happen, it's up to you to bail yourself out. Wear a suit or security guard uniform. Uh, I only have this one now. Alright, let's, let's get, get back, back to that bank vault. You, you want me to carry something for you? Security guard uniform. Next time. I need to go to my ship. Make it good. I have the deadline. What is it? Contractually, yes, but I'd rather avoid the investment. Normally, I do a good job setting boundaries between work and life. This incident is an exception. Until next time. Oh, I think I can fast travel. So we are going to Narion. Check something out. We are going steal from the trailer three two. We're going to do this. Let's go to some place new. Right. I think we can fast travel.
still can go that way. Jumping from here to there.
control rod Seize the cargo of poly soil art from the Fister Pelican 2. हजार का है लेवल फोर्टी का शेप है क्या भाई
You doing all right, Comtrop? We're home. Don't be like me. Service, Captain. About time you showed up. All right, I want to know what's going on. I've been trying to get Delgado's attention for, oh, I don't know, three years now. Now, what do I get? Nothing but radio silence. Okay, but now, know that just when Dave and I are closing in on a huge score of our own, Delgado orders me to help you out. Well, I'll be damned. Someone from the fleet finally agrees with me about something. It's a goddamn miracle. So Neva's message said you were here for Dombrowski. Was that all she sent you here to do? Or was there something else you were sent here to steal? Don't play games with me. We both know pinging a message back and forth to the key is going to take longer than we have to do this job. We're supposed to be working together on every part of this. So, you're gonna tell me what else you're here for or not? Oh, really? Did she now? I can't believe she's trying to cut me out of this deal. Without me, the award never would have ended up here in the first place. I spent months manipulating the Duran Preservation Society to host him to gather a fair board, the Siren of the Stars. I had to arrange the event to make sure that the award was aboard the ship. Mava said she'd do the rest. When I got a message about the Vosky, I assumed she'd be tagging along to steal the award. But it looks like uh, she said you were in her place. Yeah? Funny you're only bringing that out now. Fine, I'll help. But you're doing all the big work, and I'm still taking my cut of the payout. Anyway, we'll get to that later. First, we have a much bigger fish to fry. So why are you targeting a golf bank exec anyway? Not exactly your average crimson flea prey. Why the interest? His credentials. So you're hitting the Gulf Bank branch in New Atlantis. Nice score, very lucrative and very dangerous. If you're going after a gold mine like that, I'll want to come along for the ride. Or you're not getting near Dombrowski. I'll see your way around a little quid pro quo. You're insulting my intel. Delgado wouldn't send you all the way out here without specifically telling you what you're allowed to offer. I'll tell you what, though. I'm gonna make this extremely inexpensive for you. In fact, you don't have to offer me a single credit. I don't want money. I want back into the Crimson Fleet. It's as simple as that. Okay. Of course I do. But who wants to settle for a one-time payout? I prefer to play the long game. You see, getting my ass back into the fleet means I regain access to Shinya Boss. And that's as good as an endless stream of credits. You'd better, or you're gonna have to find another Gal Bank executive. As long as Dombrowski's on the ship, he's on mine. That's a disturbing way to put it. But I suppose that's the best offer I'm gonna get, so I'll take it. Dombrowski's a full-timer aboard the Siren of the Stars. 
probably spends more time cruising the space lanes than actually working. Fortunately, the Siren is hosting the Tehran Preservation Society charity gala. Larry won't be able to resist showing off his VIP clout. To get what you need, you're gonna have to attend the gala, talk to his fellow philanthropists, and dig up some dirt. Looks like we got a party to crash. And I left my tucks and tails in my other ship. <laughs> yeah, well, lucky for you, it's not black tie, so you'll be fine. This card will allow you to access the start of the boat. If you need my help, I'll be relaxing in one of the upper level lounges. Head inside and mingle with the crowd. No one likes them prosecute, so they'll be more than happy to share his dirty secret. He's a VIP executive, which means he either worked really, really hard using blood, sweat, and tears to make the arduous climb to the top, or he backstabbed, lied, cheated, and betrayed his way up the corporate ladder. From what I've heard, it's the second option. Now you're speaking my language. Oh, there's one last thing. Dryden equips all of their star liners with the latest acoustic threat detection. Meaning that you lose patience and kill anyone aboard the ship. Security will be alerted and all hell will break loose. Anyway, I suppose that's enough to get you started. Good luck. As long as you remember that I'm getting paid my cut. I'll help you with anything you want. What's the status of your plan? Okay, now let me point you to the person in charge of the award. Her name's Sheila Holbrook, and you can probably find her in the start of the book. I'd press her to reveal where the award's hidden, and we can go from there. And if you're thinking of pulling the trigger on poor Miss Holbrook, Remember that any gunfire is going to set off the ship's alarms. You seriously need to ask? Okay, I'll give you two reasons. First, Gold Bank protects their law. Kill Dombrowski, and they send ecliptic after every Crimson Fleet ship they can find. Not something they'll gotta want, I suspect. And second, you up a Gal Bank employee in every single Gal Bank facility in the settled systems will triple their security. I'm gonna guess that won't help with whatever your plans are regarding Gal Bank, now will it? They claim their goal is to we celebrate the soul of the earth, the culture, the people, and the ideals of the past. In their minds, Earth is now dead, which is why they feel. The preservation of its remaining aspects is so important. In reality, this is what happens when folks with far too much time and far too much money get together to make themselves feel like they're contributing to society. Oh, and while you're at the gala, avoid the canopies. They're frozen. So, to meet with. Two other people, I think. Captain Rokov said you're allowed in any of the cruise ships at the Galleys. Just don't touch anything, please. There's nothing quite like them for the These new persons. Captain Rokov is one of the most easygoing CEOs I've ever worked with. Okay, that's the ballroom. I 
think I should have done that later on. If you have any little ones aboard, story time of Serena will be held in the ship's library this evening. this part but uh, let me see one thing first but, uh, is there any other way to go up maybe you're a guest of captain Rokov, right welcome maybe on. not i think Trident must have spent a fortune equipping this ship between you and me. The best part of my job is getting <laughs> These newer vessels more or less run on tunnels. That looked like some quarter <coughs> of these people. Captain Rokov is one of the most easygoing seagulls that ever been. I think we are going the right way. We have to go inside the ballroom and uh, maybe start from there. So we have to meet people here. Let me see. Speak to Sheila about ES about kill Larry. These two are optional. Ask society patrons about Larry Dumrast. Okay. So we ask people about Larry, then we speak to Sheila, and then if needed we kill Larry Dombrowski or just do the job and get out of there right? so i think this is is this important i don't have a lot of time for idle nonsense sheila so before we talk to sheila i need to talk to other people hello are you a member of the society quite a lovely starliner nothing but the best for the society eh I don't know why Larry's attending this event. He could care less about any planet, let alone the Earth. Nice to have met you. So, what brings you aboard? Hmm, an open bar would have been nice, but Dragon's gouging us for every credit we've got. Dombrowski? is married to some poor woman that he constantly leaves behind in New Atlantis when he goes on his business trips. Don't forget to donate to the cause. Okay. So I think we'll start from here. I need to talk to so many people in here. In the event, please remember to obey all posted safety and mustering instructions. The society chair has really outdone herself this time. I heard her to use his Galbank's VIP suites on the Siren of the Stars almost monthly. Does the man ever do any real work? Huh. Please do make. I certainly hope they decide to hold all future society events aboard the Starliner. Let's put it this way. He screwed over so many people, if he suddenly disappeared from the universe, I don't think anyone would miss him. That's all then? Okay. Here for business or pleasure? 
The considerable amounts of cash that Dombrowski donates is the only reason we allow him to attend society functions. This guy is a low paid Indian actor. Enjoy the rest of the event. At the moment, Aurora isn't connected on Trident Starliners, though we're working on having that changed. Have you tried? Quite a lovely Starliner. Nothing but the best for the society, huh? He's been spending a lot of time with Claudia Swist. Quality time, if you catch my meaning. I'm certain his wife doesn't know a thing about it. Okay, speak to Claudia Swist. So we got an... Hmm. Well, that was boring. We got an information here. I will talk to... All of these guys. Hello, are you a member of the society? Pleased to make your acquaintance. I certainly hope they decide to hold all future society events aboard a Starliner. He's been spending a lot of time with Claudia Swist. Quality time, if you catch my meaning. I'm certain his wife doesn't know a thing about it. Don't forget to donate to the cause. So, what brings you aboard? He's been spending a lot of time with Claudia Swist. Quality time. Nice to have met. Everyone is saying the same thing. So, there is a mission that came. Speak to Claudia Swist. I'm not killing Larry. Just because he is a cheater. Maybe I can talk to everyone. That view is absolutely spectacular, isn't it? He's been spending a lot of time with Claudia Swist. Enjoy the rest of the event. Have you tried the canapes? Horrid. Positively horrid. Here for business or pleasure? He's been spending a lot of time with Claudia. That's all then? Okay. I'm yeah, uh, can we do this later? I'm busy. The society chair has really outdone herself this time. An open bar would have been nice, but Trident's couch is very critical. Quite a lovely star liner. Nothing. He's been spending a lot. Enjoy the rest of the event. That view is not as large of a device. He's been spending a lot of time with Claudia Swift. Don't forget to donate to the cause. Hello, are you, um... He's been spending. That's all then? Okay. I certainly hope they decide to hold all future society events aboard Starliner. So everyone is saying the same thing about Pleased to make your Larry and uh, the woman. Uh, He's been spending a lot of Claudia time. Claudia Swift. <laughs> well, that was boring. Have you tried it? Caught it. He's been spending a lot of time. Nice to have met. So we'll start with. Here for business. A pleasure. Okay, so this is employees only. Any complaints about your cruise should be directed to one of the staff. So, what brings you aboard? Mm, he's been spending a lot. Enjoy the rest. Okay, so it's, to be it's time. So we'll start with talking to that woman about the award, and then uh, his wife, this Dombrowski's wife. And then possibly kill Damroski or not kill Damroski in the next one. So thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more. And don't forget to subscribe. We'll be back with more exciting videos. And most probably I will post RDR2 video on the 25th. And uh, continue from there. So 23rd and 24th you will not get any RDR2 video. 
sorry for that in advance but i will post back to back fortnite videos this two days so stay tuned and have a good day guys take care bye